Hey Internet, this will be a 2-on-1 video. Quick summary of what happened two weeks ago. My SSD decided to die. I'm using my hard drive right now, reformatted it. Let me just minimize and show you my desktop. It's got the bare minimum. Okay, first topic. Let's go in hard. Uh, would my past selves be proud of who I am today? It depends which age I was and who you ask, I guess. So which version you ask. For my teenagers, they'll be like, yeah, they're a bit disappointed. They expect more. I think the 18 year old be like, I'm just glad you made it. From the 20s to, so 20 to 24, they'll be like, yeah, I'm, I think you did all right. You made it. 24 to 30. I think those versions would be like sigh of relief. Be like, you went through hell. You made it. All right. And then of course, 31 year old me. Am I proud of who I'm at right now? I'm still learning. Keeping it humble. All right. So that's pretty deep. Or maybe not deep enough, I guess. So, second one's a bit more lighthearted. It's sort of just a retelling of my life um, in short form. So, I'm sure you've heard of the saying, you are the main character of your own story. So I just paraphrased it. If I was an anime protagonist, what would my character arcs be? Different way of saying the same thing. Life in itself is a training arc. You're gaining new experiences learning skills, learning stuff in general. Okay, so let's begin. High school, didn't really like it. So that was the high school arc. Um, yeah, nothing to say. I don't think anyone likes high school. I mean, some people do, but yeah. All right, and New Zealand arc, why is this significant? Um, even though I didn't, it didn't work out for me because, like, the odds of getting hired when you do the course, it's only 10%. So, like, 90 people do the course, 9 people get hired. I wish, yeah, had I known then, I would have skipped it. Clean the arc, first job. So, yeah, I realized. Yeah, cleaning toilets is not what I want to do for the rest of my life. Which uh, sparked me into getting an apprenticeship. So, I wouldn't say the Air New Zealand arc was completely useless. Like, the pre-trade, I got the pre-trade from this anyways. Which allowed me to get into the apprenticeship. So, I guess that helped. Um, yeah. In truth, I could have just skipped this and just did the MIT course. Um, yeah. So, the apprentice arc um, was good until the apprentice apocalypse happened. And, yeah. I had to start from zero. Um, so, figuring out what to do with my life slash the lost arc. Yeah, there's a couple of months where I'm just figuring out so at that point um, I was no longer an apprentice the company just like fired a whole bunch of apprentices not just me uh, yeah but yeah during this time I was lost hence the lost arc uh, I just had to figure out what I want to do in life and I just yeah and I guess I still wanted to be an engineer, so the next arc was the MIT arc. The don't get it twisted, it's not Massachusetts, it's the Manukau Tech. So from there, I got my training in, got, you know, they taught me a little bit of um, stuff about engineering. Honestly, the apprentice arc taught me a lot more but yeah I feel like 
all of these are building blocks. High school arc, I mean, I worked on cars and stuff, so that kind of helped. And that got me a free trade arc, so, I mean, that got me. So, ERNZ, free trade, cleaner, gave me the motivation. Then this, I actually started learning engineering. So it's all falling into place. It's all like stepping stones, I suppose. All right, and yeah, the MIT arc got some solid work skills from it, which led me to the university arc, and yeah, did a mechanical engineering degree. So yeah, university was hell. It was hard. Failed sometimes. Had to repeat. Four year degree did it in five years. It's all right. I made it. Just. All right, so we are now in the uh, end game, I guess. So this is my current arc, the engineering job arc. It's good. Um, yeah, boss gave me some feedback where I need to improve, and yeah, you know, that's kind of both good and bad. He's for a bit of word I'm literally benched so I'm doing bench work like assembly and manufacturing until I get enough XP to go back into the office which is fair but yeah they don't really have time to train me so I need to train myself so yeah I was going with the baseball metaphor you know or like sports metaphor when you're bench, you're not really doing the active uh, thing. You're just the reserve. But that's okay. That's all right. I guess you just got to prove yourself. Just start from the bottom. And yeah, that's okay. So they hired me to be a designer. But they want me to get more XP first, so that's okay. I think that's a kind of a good boss like they realize that you need more XP so we need to train you up from the bottom up so I think that's okay we'll see we'll find out I mean we'll find out if they just continually bench me or you know they're gonna let me rise again we'll find out um, yeah I'm skeptical and then yeah, I don't know. I guess during that time, maybe the next arc I should probably focus on is this, but maybe in between that, probably life skills arc, to be honest. Yeah, um, before I go into the relationship arc or, yeah, life skills arc, yeah, um, not much to say about it, that's just sort of kind of going through the motions um, life skills arcs like uh, you know your basic stuff uh, cooking all that stuff washing just like reliving the renting life again I guess Okay, um, you would think this is juicy, but it's not. It's really not. Um, yeah. So I guess there's some social pressure and just getting a little bit older, you know. Just maybe I just want to find someone to share my life with. So um, nothing juicy, really. Uh, yeah. Arcs in progress. Um, so I think... Uh, in my older videos I talked about um, online dating and stuff and how it's yuck um, yeah Tinder's not for me Tinder is not for me uh, how am I doing now uh, still bad but you know using not using Tinder now so that's something um, yeah Maybe, you know, eventually, 
Hopefully I can find someone soon. And there it is. It would be cool to like have another decade on and then like make another um, training arc video. That'd be cool. And apologies, I don't have my camera right now. Well, I do, but I just can't set it up just because even this computer uh, crashes as well. Okay. Uh, even if I found someone, I'd probably just keep it on a DL, you know. It's either, yeah, some people are fine with sharing it to the world, but I don't know. Kind of just want to keep it personal, you know. Um, yeah. Watch the space, I guess. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess the next arc after that is the family arc, right? Um, we'll find out. These two probably won't happen until years. Well, that will, this one won't happen until years later. This one maybe soon. Maybe not. Okay, I think that's all my arcs. So we're up to date. So I am currently here. I am here. Yeah, the moving out part. Prodigal Sun returns. And yeah. Just gotta get ready to go out and see the world again. Kinda like how this pandemic is turning out. Alright. Thanks for watching. Hope you had a great day. Be sure to like, subscribe, share with your friends, ring the bell, turn on all notifications, leave a comment below if you are enjoying these videos. I'll end it here before the computer crashes. Until next time, see ya.